March 10th, 2008. This is the day I started playing Roblox. Crimson Zero was the, uh, the first account I have ever made on Roblox. Way back in the day, this was considered one of the best games for me. You would either be a cop or a robber way over there, and you'd have to drive all the way to this bomb and explode it. This isn't what Roblox looked like. Like, this looks pretty good, but like 10 years ago when I started playing, things looked way different. You know, let me explain it to you. We're talking way back in the day when I just spammed everyone to watch my stupid YouTube videos. This was on like a really old Roblox uh, YouTube channel. They came out with a game that basically shows perfectly how bad and how terrible Roblox used to look like back in the day when I first started playing. These used to be like the play button. See, everything looked terrible. You only had t-shirts. Like you only had things that covered like your like big fat chest. <laughs> This game is so perfect. There was like hardly like any hats too. They came out with a hat like every week and it was all like really basic dumb looking stuff like this. Oh, I miss this so much. Back then, this used to be the most expensive hat in the world. Yeah, there was no shirts and pants. Everyone, it was like the cavemen days. Nobody had clothes. I'll show you like the one, I think maybe the first game I've ever played, if not one of the first. This was the loading screen. It was bad. Everything was bad news. And things took a very, very long time to load. We didn't have detailed shadows like this back in the day though. I think that's because my graphics are all the way up. Let's see here. Okay, well, we still have the shadows, but you could like... How I moved around was you had this green disc here. It was like, it was like RuneScape or something if you ever played that. So I would just click around. <laughs> See how this is how bad everything looked. And we had like little little circly things as the as the blocks. Roblox was like insane because you could actually like blow stuff up. Like no game had that. I'm going down memory lane right now. I feel like this is like emotional. Let's put parentheses emotional in the title because I am feeling these emotions. You could leave a bomb here. Oh, that was not a bomb. There we go. Oh, no, that's not, I'm pretty sure bombs were like instant death. <laughs> this stupid fly tool. I miss this so much. Why am I not a kid anymore? See guys, this was my childhood. Here, where is this other guy? See, everybody looked like noobs too and the game was like pretty laggy. Like, look, yep. That was, that was what we did back in the day. We were, everybody was jerks to each other. Actually, I feel like people are, are like much meaner now. Hey, shoot me. Yeah, try, try that again. Try that again, little boy. Yeah, you thought I was going to fight fair? No, I wasn't. But yeah, this green disc over here. That's like, because I didn't know. I was using this instead of arrow keys for the longest time and it was so hard to move around. Yeah, this paintball gun was useless. This was useless. You guys have no idea how lucky you are to have the Roblox you have today. This was one of the better made games. This was made by like one of the people who made Roblox too. So like, this was like, <laughs> this was like top notch stuff right here. Basically what you had to do was not get hit by these things and make it to the very end. It's literally impossible. I've only done it like three times in my whole life. Uh, 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 uh. See, they don't even have to touch you to kill you. Oh, I wish they had like more of like the role play games though. <laughs> well, this is gonna sound weird, but well, I, I would always do this. I would always go to like these hotel games and like pretend to be a girl and then like, <laughs> And then just make it super awkward and be like, hey, I was a boy the whole time. That's like how I, that's how I would have fun as a kid. I was very bored. <sighs> Let's see if I can do this. No, 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 no. I'm surrounded. See, the thing is, Roblox looked way worse than this too. Like, everything looked really bad. You can look at like very old YouTube videos. It's crazy to see that like Roblox is like... Oh, this is always the hardest part. Let me go. Let me go. Let me go. Let me go. I, I'm about to do it. I'm about to do it. Yeet! I did it. And every time someone made it to the end, they made it like way harder. Oh, look, now they're making it less harder. See, look at this guy. You think you, you think you're good at this game? Well, you're not. I will send my teapots after you. I don't know why my screen keeps moving like that. I don't know why this is happening. Oh, in the moon right here. Uh, you could go back in like your Roblox game files and edit what the moon looked like. It only showed up for you. 
But I would always put Carlton Banks from Fresh Prince of Bel-Air. I would always have him as like the moon face. You could like edit what the moon looked like on your like on your in-game files and stuff. And I would put his face right there. That would be my moon. That's what would be staring at me in the middle of the night. I had to go through rigorous therapy to get uh, that image out of my head. Basically, this was the scariest game on Roblox. Uh, and you're going to see <laughs> how low the bar was for scary in this game. There we go. See, this was actually like top-notch top notch technology, being able to open doors like that. Uh, where is it? Red room, red room, red room. See, like that was terrifying back in the day. And I think there's like a, like a zombie or something or like a ghost that comes after you down here. I can't remember. Also, you jumped very slowly. You couldn't, like, do the bunny hops like you can do today. Okay, I guess this game is making a liar out of me. There's no, there's no goblins and ghouls coming after me. This type of stuff was considered scary. See, you hear that thunder? It's, like, very glitched. But see, occasionally, you'll get a full thunder. You want to see what Roblox looked like back in the day? I'll show you. It was bad. It was beautiful, actually. All right, let's go to 2008, because that's when I started playing. I haven't seen this in a while, so like March something around here. <laughs> it looked like this. What was this? Can I play this? Yeah, see, this is the video that would like blast in your ears every time you'd log in. This is like, hearing this music again is just like, beautiful. <laughs> look how bad all these games looked. Like these were people's games. These are what games looked like. Let's see what the most popular games were back in the day. Please show me. I just want to see how bad they are. The virus is spreading. Go I remember this one, Paintball Tycoon. Build to survive Michael Jackson. What? Build your own house or adopt a kid. See, this is where all the adopt and raise a cute baby games came from. See, we had no like pretty pictures for the games or anything. People just like, see, this was like the best it could get, like the picture for the game. Go camping. I remember this game. This was terrible. Destroy the giant SpongeBob. Pastry Factory Tycoon. Honestly, the games are not that much different from today. <laughs> Except now they're called Escape Giant SpongeBob. Impossible when to be admin obstacle course. See, the games are pretty much the same thing now. Blow up the planes. Ex there's literally a gate. Wait. Yeah, look, survive plane crash. It's like the same thing. I feel like Roblox, like, has developed since then, but, like, hasn't at the same time. Like, mentally, we're all still back in this day and age. Oh, the parents page. This is where, like, kids would have to click, like, if their parents didn't want them playing the game. Keep your kids safe on Roblox. But like, you'd have to show your parents this to, like, let them let you play the game. See, I try to look up my old character. As you can see, this number means I'm, like, the 230,000th person to sign up to Roblox. So I'm pretty old. Okay, we'll go back to the Super Nostalgia Zone game in a second. Let's see. See, these were the items. Items we had we had four pages of items you have like 1,000 pages of items now they just didn't care about making hats back in the day this is back when we had tickets too big let's give a big fat rest in peace to the tickets to all those tickets out there see it's not actually loading the game as it says here it's waiting for the advertisement to finish so we got about another three minutes left okay see that's what I don't like about new Roblox. If you don't have Builders Club, you just get that blasted in your ears. This is the paintball game. I was actually very bad at this. This was like the only like shooting game we had. It was very fun. It didn't work very well, as you can see. Unfortunately, there's nobody to play with. So I guess we're gonna have to go to a different one. This was the fun game. I took this game very seriously and I would get very mad if I, if I didn't win. See, I gotta go heal now. Hey, what you didn't know is I was right here. Yes. Oh yeah. Also, we had these little these circly Lego things on our on our shoulders. I think I think uh, Roblox got like sued by Lego because they stole the circle things, so they had to change them into squares, something like that. See what you had to do back in the day to survive? You had to just jump on someone. You had to wait for them to go right under you. You have to wait a long time, apparently. Somebody just walk under me, please. Okay, okay, we got our first victim over here. Hello, and goodbye. Ooh. Oh, no! Okay, wait, we're gonna leave. We're gonna leave before we can die. Have we left? Okay, good. 
Good call, Albert. See, this was like a scientific discovery. Like, you could... Oh, is this broken? This this whole, like, table thing is, is supposed to, like, tip over. This is supposed to be like a little balance board, but... <laughs> they forgot to make it work, I guess. Oh, wait, there we go, there we go. See, this was like scientific discoveries in Roblox. Like, the... <laughs> The, the games were not that good. See, look, it's just tipping over. That, that was the whole game. You just you just tip it over. Then if you're lucky, you just fall off and, and die. And then you then you don't have to play this game anymore. Yep, there we go. Just keep just keep going. Keep it keep it going. It's like tipping the iceberg in Club Penguin, if any if any of you uh, remember that. Just there we go. Okay, now we can we can leave peacefully. Back in my day, we used to have to explode buildings to have fun. I I used to spend hours here exploding buildings. Now you guys have Meep City parties. Now you guys can just do whatever you want. Back then, we just had to do whatever whatever we could. You know what? I actually don't like this guy. Uh, hi, hi, you say? How about bye? I honestly didn't even need to do that to him, but I did. You know, that's just the type of person I am. Oh, yeah, yeah, the faces on Roblox, you had no option. You had to have this face, and it was pointy. Like, it was pointy and weird. No, but the basis of this video is, you don't have any idea how good you have it, but this version of Roblox was still fun because we didn't really know that there was something better out there, which is Roblox today. I mean, old Roblox wasn't that bad. But, like I said, it's because we didn't know what was out there, which is new Roblox, the thing you guys play. But if any of you have been playing this game for like almost 10 years like me, you know the struggle. You know how great the old times used to be, but then you look at the new games and you're like, how did I play old Roblox? I don't know guys, I, don't, I guess this video was kind of like, for me to show you what the old times were like, help you appreciate what you got now. No, but as you guys know, like, we still, like, to, in today's age, we still got, like, pretty much the same games, though. Adopt and Raise a Cute Baby. We got, like, at least three million games that have, like, Escape something in them. Like, Escape High School. I'm glad I could share my little tale with you. I'm- I hope you, uh, appreciate it. Let's go to my old, old Roblox YouTube channel. See, I used to make, like, videos of me- Oh, six years ago. Alright, let's see this. <laughs> this is so bad. <laughs> see, guys, this is- This isn't that old of Roblox. This is just 2011, but still. Like, this was entertainment to me. Or maybe that time when literal- Literal account named Roblox was in the game. Like- Wait, 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 look. See, the account Roblox played a game, so I was just like, hey, I got I got a good idea. I'm gonna start spamming in the game because it'd be funny. It wasn't funny. I think I just got banned. Look. They banned me from the game, then they banned me off uh, the website for 14 days. See, guys, this was... This was back in 2012. I'm a reformed man. I'm a good man now. I'm 20 years old. Uh, I forgot my age for a second. So that means I've been playing this game for almost half of my life. Say it's sad, say whatever, I still like the game. So please stop bullying me this instant. Normal videos will go up tomorrow and stuff. You know the drill, videos every day, subscribe if you're not subscribed. Just wanted to share my life story with you since Roblox has been a part of me for half of my life, almost. If my calculations are correct, I don't know. What is this? Anyways, uh, bye.